Hello, all right. Hello, I'm going to do just a quick refraction. I'm only doing the most basic refraction. I'm not doing a full refraction, mm -hmm. all right? Uh, I just know that you've been struggling with the TV. Yeah. So just want to see if it's your TV it's, that's at fault or if it's your eyes. So I've got this trial frame. I'm just gonna put this on here. It'd be better if I get it behind your ears. That looks all right to me. Just, that's it. What I would like you to do is just look at the chart and just read down for me. What's the smallest you could read on there? I can read A, C, D, U, Z, B, H, F, K, which I think is the third from the bottom. Yep, it is. I've got and it. I can read some underneath. C, H, H, F, L, D, T, U, PZ, but it's blurry. Excellent, excellent. I'm just going to occlude your left eye. As you're an optometrist, you can just put that in for me. Excellent. The the line that you've read partially, so that's the second from the bottom. Mm. If I just put this lens in, can you tell me if this is better or worse? It's slightly worse. What if I put this in front? Slightly better. What about that one? It's about the same. And that one there. It's a little bit better. If I just put that in front. It's slightly better again. Okay. And how's that? It's not too bad. Excellent. And I'm not going to put this one in, but what's it like with that in front? That's more blurry. And as I turn it round, it's about the same, really. It's a little bit sharper, maybe. Yeah. And sharper. Mm -hmm. Excellent. I'm going to leave it at that. If you'd like to take your occluder out. Maybe you slot it in front or in, in the back of the other one. Now what's the best you can read now? Second to bottom, I think it's C-H-N-L-F-L. I'll T a U. You've got most of that right. I'm just going to slot this lens in. Is that better or worse or about the same? Slightly better.
And is it any better if I do that? Slightly, yeah. That's slightly better. Yeah, slightly better. You can try reading that line again for me. C H N F L E T U something Z. You did a little bit better than the first time. No. What if I do that? Slightly more blurry. Still blurry. Is that slightly better? Yeah, there's not much in that at all, really. That's, yeah, slightly better, I'd say. Sorry. Yeah. Now let's try it with both eyes together. Bottom row. I can do it better backwards. U N T X R Y D B A. Perhaps. It was close. You've got most of them right. I'm just going to include your left eye again and what I'm doing now is just using some of these other lenses just to see if these filters make any difference whatsoever. So first of all that's worse Yeah, do you want to hold it in front? Because you'll have it in the right place. Yeah, that doesn't make much difference. Is that slightly worse? It's because you've only got a slot to look through. No, for a friend or prism. Yeah, that's worse as well. I was hoping you'd say it's worse. Yeah. Because it is supposed to make the refractive index a little bit worse. Now for the spot. It's about can, the same, really. When you get the focus, you can see, but it's just finding a spot, isn't it? Mm, it seems to dim things. That's the only problem with the pinhole. The reason it's more difficult as well is because I've got the test chart a little bit high. And now this one should actually take away all the vision. Oh, yeah. That's a Shivas lens. That's a plan our lens to catch out the malingerers. It doesn't make any difference. Very good. Is that right? Yes, it is correct. 
Why have I got two Plano lenses in here? <laughs> oh. You can see the world through rose tinted lenses now. Yeah, that's actually slightly better, even though everything's very red. It's much more relaxing, isn't it? I like the colour red for lights and filters. I'm just going to put one prism in front. And that bends the light, doesn't it? Mm. As I do that, it puts it into a completely different yeah. place. The first time wasn't too bad. Yeah. It just changes the size a little bit, that's all. Yeah. Right, I think that'll do for that. I'll try them lenses now in the other eye. Not necessarily in the same order. That's worse vision, but it does maybe cut the glare down from the light. Couldn't see anything at all then. Again, that was the Shivas lens, so. Yeah, that's not very good at all. And it moves as I turn the dial, doesn't mm, it? I can see a, a line. You might want to hold this in front because it's the spot lens. Possibly slightly better, but there's really not a lot of difference. Again, it just seems to dim the light from the side, so that's it. Yeah, it's hard. You hold to... this one now because I'll do the slotted lens at the same time. This one better or worse? Or about the same? Let's take it away. Same. Good. I'm glad you said that because that's the plan of lens. Yeah, so it might be slightly better. Makes the black a bit blacker. Alright. I'm just going to try one of the prisms. I'm using a larger prism on this eye. It's about the same, it just moves the chart. That makes it smaller. Yeah, we should say the same. All right, that's it. I'm just going to write down the findings. I'll take that off here. Yeah. So what I've found for the right eye minus O fifty with a minus O two five sill. And that's at 125. And for the left eye, I found minus 075, minus 025 at 90. All right, 
that would definitely improve your television.